Hello friends, welcome. In this video, I'm going to work with uh, logout because right now, if uh, we log in, for example, here, let's log in with uh, John Doe.com and let's add the password. Okay, we are directed and we have here John. Now I want to hide the login and register because we are authenticated and show the log out button and when we click we can uh, log out and to log out we need to uh, destroy the cookie here so if i destroy that and refresh we are not logged in so we make a request to get the user but we have 401 okay and also one more thing if i go and log in and let's uh, open the inspect element go to the network and let's say john dot dot com and add the password as you can see we make uh, three times to get the user and that's it because let's open the vs code inside the auth context i forget the await the get user so we need to await get user here and also on the register await get user and with that now if i save and let's log out so refresh we are not logged in let's go to the network and let's go to the login I'm going to clear here and let's say test or John Doe dot com and add the password. Hit enter and now we make only one uh, request to get the user because we wait for the to get the user here and we have the user assigned. Okay. Now let's work with that uh, logic, the logout, and let's me open here with the VS Code the backend, and inside the roads we have this out.php which is for the authentication routes, and we have here the logout. We need to make a post request to the logout, and this controller have the store and the destroy and it's going to say as guard web logout it's going to invalidate the session and it's going to regenerate the token and return response no content okay so back here and run artisan serve okay now in the auth context let's create one method to log out in here i'm going to say const logout it's going to be an async function not not async just like this and what we need we need the post access post dot the slash logout so axios dot post the slash logout and then we need to set the user the node so we can say then set user to null okay let's save and let's use now this logout in here i'm going to save that and close and this one we need to use in the app jsx here let's import first like this copy and 
paste it here and then what we want from the use of contact is the user and the logout here so i'm going to say const object user and logout which is going to be people with use out context and now down there we have a navigation we have a link for the home but the link for the login and for the register i'm going to show only if the user is not authenticated so i'm going to cut this and let's say if we have a user we are going to show the login the logout then we are going to show the, the these two links so if we have a user let's copy this one and instead of something like this we just paste that one the login is not going to be this is not going to be a link is going to be a button so let's say a button okay we don't need this one and this is going to be a logout just now let's see if everything works so if we have a user we show this link otherwise we show the lo login and register so go back and oh yeah file the import because we just copy and paste from the login but here we are in the source directory so we need to say just like this and now as you can see we have logout okay we have logout and we need to use that logout so i'm going to scroll down here when we have a button i'm going to say on click of this button we need to call that logout add the pointer to that logout if i click now yeah we are logged out and we have login and register and here we are in the home let's refresh as you can see we have 401 we don't have the user let's go and log in with john dot com at the password login and we are in the home and we have home and the logout okay friends and if you go here to the application in the cookie when we log out you can see here is going to update so let's say log out and yeah the values for the laravel session and csrf token is changed that's it about this video i hope you enjoy and if you like don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video and see you in the next one all the best thank you very much